And tonight, maybe our sharpest look yet at 3i Atlas, that mysterious interstellar object racing through our solar system. And check this out. This is a new image. It shows it glowing greenish, streaming jets. And if you look closely, there is that rare anti-tail. The astrophotographer behind that incredible shot joins us now from my favorite state in the world, New Mexico. Asaturo uh, Murata, great to see you. Thanks so much for being with us. I know you've been chasing comets for a while. What makes this one stand out to you? Anything that, that surprised you when you were capturing this image? Well, so as you know, 3i means it's the third interstellar object that, that we have discovered in the last, I think, eight years. The first two uh, have been very faint, um, pretty much impossible for us amateurs to capture. This one, uh, early, even in July, we were able to start to see it with amateur instrument. Um, so I started look, following it at that point. And lo and behold, you know, three, four months later, it actually looks like a comet, which is like super fascinating. <laughs> yeah, it, it actually looks like a comet. I've heard uh, it said that comets are like cats. They have tails and they kind of do whatever they want. This one has generated a million questions, a lot of like really wild um, headlines, if you will. But uh, I got to ask, as, as a person that's seen this through your telescope, like, what do you think it is? I mean, you know, when we heard it's an interstellar object, there's always the possibility, we think, uh, that, that it could be, you know, something artificial. Uh, but at this point, uh, with uh, the streams coming out, the ionic tail that you see uh, going toward the right, the anti-tail is the leftover little dust particles as it went around the sun. This is pretty much consistent with, you know, uh, a lot of the other comets that uh, we, we see. So I am, you know, pretty positive at this point that this is just a comet, um, very unique in that it's not from our solar system. Oh my gosh, please tell me that at some point in your life, uh, you've overheard people talking about how this is aliens and they're like, I, I, I actually have seen this thing with, with my own eyes. Has that happened in your life yet? Uh, an interstellar object or an alien spaceship? No, no. Have you run into people that are convinced that this is aliens and you've had to talk to them and tell them, like, no, I've actually taken a oh, picture wow. of it and I think... <laughs> I think this is probably a comment. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Um, and, and, you know, as a scientist, uh, every scientist would tell you, you can't ever rule it out uh, that it is some uh, artificial uh, alien civilization um, object. Uh, but, you know, I will say to them, you know, as a comet chaser, this looks like a comet. Um, I posted some, I think, on my Instagram. If it looks like a duck and it behaves like a duck, it is a duck. And I would call this a comet. <laughs> Ah, Satoru, thank you so very much for sharing all this with you. And happy hunting those New Mexico skies. They are the best uh, out there. So thank you so much. We thank you for watching. And remember, stay updated on breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or watch live on our YouTube channel.